Friday morning, friends. If you missed it earlier, it's our sweet Nicole's birthday. Yeah. And, and it's Valentine's Day. Which so is about love. We said, how do we surprise her? Mm -hmm. So we made a little da dad and tines message yes. for her. Her dad A live dad and tines message. And Nick, talk to us about what <laughs> happened. You got a oh, Are you crying again? <laughs> Nick, you know what's crazy? While we were watching it, Rosh and I were getting all teary eyed because we could tell. I know. It's so. You think he lives on the other side of the world, but that's yeah, how it is. You didn't so expect beautiful. it. Beautiful. And then you hear your dad, and it was so sweet. And then it hits you, right? Like a bunch of rose petals. And look how sweet she is. It was so nice that your dad I just did that. I'm so lucky. I'm like so blessed. I have good family and friends and you guys like doing all this work and stuff. It's really sweet. It means oh, a lot. Thank you. So we love, <laughs> we love like, you. It's a delayed reaction. I was like, okay. oh my God. And then it's all like sinking in now and now I'm, I'm an emotional wreck. It's, it's great. Okay. It, was a bit, it was a bit crazy. Yeah. You, didn't, you didn't know what was coming and all of a sudden dad's on the other side. Yeah. And you're like, is that dad? And it's a good surprise because yeah. life has too surprise. many, you know, twists and turns and sad things. And it's a beautiful, happy one. So we want to thank your dad again. He was so sweet to do that for us. But we have a question, Nick. <laughs> wow. yeah. He kept saying, was he saying dad? dad? Do you have a nickname, something yeah. like that? <laughs> okay. He was like, hi, what dad. <laughs> Happy birthday, dad. What was I love that? you, dad. We're like, is it dad or is it a nickname? <laughs> okay, so my my dad does this thing where he calls me dad. And we say, <laughs> dad, dad. And it's like, I don't know what it is. It's maybe de like, it's like a European thing of like term of endearment. It's like saying like, bella mia. Like, yeah. it's oh, that's like, awesome. And that's how like my dad like says it. But it sounds really weird to other people. And I thought that after the, after the hit was like, people are going to think it's so weird. We my thought dad that too. Me dad. <laughs> <laughs> this is adorable. Thank you. I love like, that. Is your dad crazy? <laughs> no, it's beautiful. It's wonderful. <laughs> it's adorable. And that's what makes relationships <laughs> so unique. The nuances. It's the little things little like, that. like that. Absolutely. <laughs> Dry your beautiful yeah, you guys eyes, Nick. Firsthand. Okay, now get to work. Oh, we love you, Nick. So much. Love you, Nick. I love you guys. I love you guys so much. Send you lots of love and happy Valentine's Day. No more tears. We're here at the home show. We have to be happy. Absolutely. <laughs> of course. Just, just tell me what we have here because you are kind of showcasing some of the different trends and the different yes. types of homeowners and how you kind of can incorporate who you are um, through design. Exactly. So my philosophy is that your home should always reflect who you are uh -huh. and you should always have things in your home that you love and th or either that or that has function, <laughs> right. right? So like kind of going into personality and styles that are also super on trend right now, we have that earth conscious person. So okay. we're bringing in lots of um, natural fibers, um, dried stuff like dried flowers, dried grasses as decor is now coming back in. So you can mix this in with even fresh flowers and stuff. You're Beautiful. bringing in natural elements that you're finding like on the beach, mm -hmm. um, in the forest, that kind of stuff. Natural fibers like cotton. And then even wallpaper, of course, is on trend, but yes, having something that looks almost like and it's textured too. Exactly. It's really, really cool. Exactly, like a ship I like lap, the way that this feels. barn board. So that's on trend. Beautiful. For so we've got kind of the nature esque person. And then right. what do we have over here? So we this have is awesome farmhouse piece. modern. Farmhouse modern. Farmhouse modern. So you're going to get into like a lot of um, black hardware, picking up really cool vintage pieces like this that I picked up at a farmer's market. That's what or, I was just going to yeah. ask you. So where do you kind of find these really special pieces? So there's a pieces? really cool place outside of Toronto called Aberfoil. So they have a lot of cool pieces. Okay. I even got this print there too. So that's bringing in that farmhouse modern too with just and like it's those touches that exactly. really make it. Totally. And it's just like hits here and there. You're bringing in also the cable knit sweat like sweater yeah. look in your pillows and in your blankets and then also like a wallpaper style for kind of this little trend fun. is doing something like this a really large fun. wide scale plaid i love that so this is that it's, modern take I on the plaid i was just going to say it's a modern take which exactly. i really love and let's talk about this last look over here. Okay, so this last one is kind of that vintage industrial look. So a lot of people it's giving are, me like loft vibes, total loft right? vibes, absolutely. So you have like a lot of that um, architectural stuff that's exposed, picking up again some really cool architectural pieces like this. Very You're bringing cool. again in, the textures. We were talking about velvet or a little bit earlier. Velvet as well. heavy stuff, so leather, mm -hmm. velvet. Um, all kinds of. If you don't have a loft, you can fake it with some wallpaper. Totally, <laughs> absolutely, you can definitely fake do it till you make it, and you still get the same vibe. Absolutely, that's awesome. Thank you so much, Miss oh, Jen. Welcome. We're gonna throw Thanks it back for coming over to by. Roger and Dina. Bye.